Hi, and welcome to Hammer's Hacks, brought to you by Gold Tip Arrows and V-Singer Stabilizers. I'm your host, Tim Gellingham, and on each episode, I'll give you a simple tip, something that you probably didn't even consider that will help you become a better archer in bow hunting. Hey, everybody, it's Hammer's Hacks. Um, I got another little tip for you. One of the things that I, I look for in, in hunting stabilization uh, setups, you know, there are a lot of options, but I want to show you what it is I use and why I use it. Okay. This is something that Beastinger came out with a few years ago. It was called the counter slide. Now the counter slide basically takes a long bar system like this 15 inch bar. And it just allows you instead of a two bar system, like a lot of guys like it allows you to turn it into a more compact system. Now this bar sits off the side of your bow like this so instead of coming out of the very front of your bow it comes off the side now that allows us to take a quiver full of arrows and offset the weight of it you know i've got the side over here the overdraw over here i've got my my quiver full of arrows so by putting that off the riser a little bit it really has a very good leveraging effect on that and helps hold that bow nice straight you know on your level level in your sight every time so that's a very um, advantageous uh, feature of this particular uh, stabilizer. Now, we we initially made it with just a screw-on bracket. Now we have a dovetail bracket. So just like your sight, you can take it on and off if you like. Um, I pretty much lock mine down with a set screw. I just don't like stuff coming loose. But uh, And then you can add whatever weight you want. So if you're going to go light i highly recommend you go long okay and if you see how i have mine set up i have eight ounces here eight ounces in the back and that's kind of where i've discovered that it it tends to aim the very best okay um but you can configure them with two or three on each end it's just you know i prefer to shoot a little heavier bow in the field i just think at the moment of truth it helps me a lot but one of the things i wanted to show you is if one of the one of the big considerations you got to you know you you want to be aware of is that if if I'm out spot and stock hunting, it's probably not going to make a big difference whether I run a two bar system, a one bar system, or a system like this. But if you're in a tree stand, or you know you're going to be shooting a lot of vertical stuff like this, you have to be very aware. A lot of guys will mount their back bars in these lower holes or down here like this. But you have to be very careful on the length of that because as you point downhill, that is going to, like most people sitting in a tree stand, that is gonna run into your leg and can get in the way. So that's one of the reasons I like this counter slide. It sits right up here underneath my arm. So no matter where I'm at here, it, it stays out of the way. So if you've never tried, uh, you know, this type of a system, I would highly recommend it. Um, I think it's very, very efficient in terms of uh, stabilizing a hunting bow. The very first thing you want to cancel out with a hunting bow is you do not want the bow when you shoot to react like this. That's got to stop. So you do that by shifting the forward to center forward. And that's what I've done here. Okay. Short bows, especially they, they like to do this, you know, so um, you want that bow to react neutral, like kind of straight out or slightly this way, okay? And you do that with leverage, okay? Leverage is either more stabilizer length out here or more weight out here or a combination of both. So hope that helps. That's Hammer's Hacks for the week. And let's just keep them in the middle. Hey, before you go, there's some great ways to keep getting even more info and tips. Subscribe to Gold Tip Archery Ops podcast to hear my conversation with top experts in archery and bow hunting. You can also check out Gold Tip on Facebook, Instagram, and our YouTube channel. Thanks for listening, and always start tough and stay true out there.